Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today is a Sephora haul. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today what I'm going to be doing is showing you my Sephora haul. So I hope you're super excited to see all the goodies that I picked up at Sephora. And if you're interested in seeing that, well then please just keep watching. I should seriously own stock in Sephora. First we have red paper as usual and then I am just going to pull out. The Sephora My Current City just opened so that's why I went there to check it out and if you're like one of the first 100 customers you get a little Sephora baggie and it comes with like sample stuff inside like a bunch of just different little samples and things like that. So that was pretty cool. So this baggie was free. Next out of my baggie, oh I have a little bitty baby story to tell you out of this. I was at the Becca counter and a lady was standing there next to me and I wanted really, really badly their highlighter in Opal. So I figured I would go online and order it. They are sold out. So I went back to the store to get it and the lady standing next to me sees me frantically like digging through all the highlighters trying to find the Opal. She just looks at me and she's like, are you looking for Opal? I was like, yes, but I think they're sold out, you know. She was like, here, just take mine. I have the last one in my hand. And I was just like, what? She's like, I just have it in my hand. I was thinking about getting it, but I'm not going to. You just take it. I was like, oh my gosh, like the makeup gods are here with me. So I did get Opal and that's how I got it. I got the last one because a sweet angel lady gave me hers, which that'll never happen again, but that was pretty awesome. So it looks like this. Um, Becca has a very masculine packaging, I think, but I think it looks pretty cool. Ugh, it is just so beautiful. Like seriously, if you do get a chance to get Opal, I highly recommend just splurging and picking it up because I think it was like 38 bucks, which is pretty expensive for just a little highlighter here. But you do get a lot. Oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. Like I can't get over it. Like I need to just stop. And all of Becca products, they're a little bit on the expensive side, but they are just the best quality that you can. And next in my baggie, I picked up another Becca product. This is a blush, one of their mineral blushes, and this is Damselfly. I should have opened all these already, but I just left them in the bag. Okay. So this is Damselfly. It's a little bit smaller, as you can see, but the exact same packaging here. So it is a peachy pink color and it has an iridescent sheen over it. You can kind of tell these blushes are oh my gosh like the most buttery rich in color blushes you will ever find. They are so pigmented. I love them so much and these are $32 so they're a little bit pricey but I think they're worth it because of just the quality of them. It's just simply amazing. So I'm so obsessed with this one and again this is Damsel Fly. Next what I got was their summer stash. If you are working hard on getting your makeup collection to grow, I highly recommend getting Sephora's favorites little stash baggies. They always have perfumes and mascara, their summer favorites, glitz and glams. They have a ton of different variety of these and these will really help your makeup collection grow. Now the sizes of these are kind of smaller but again you get a little bit of everything for a much cheaper price. This was $42. Let me show you what it came with. First of all, it comes with this adorable little makeup bag, which I think is so cute. Then you get a mini Stila foiled pigment and kitten, which is the gold one, which I think is just absolutely gorgeous. You get this nail polish by Deborah Lipman, which is called Mermaid, and it's just a really, really sparkly, beautiful nail polish. You get one of the Their Real Mini Mascaras. You get the mini, which I think this is going to be great to throw in my purse, the All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. So yes, this is just to help your makeup stay on longer. So you get the Aqua Eyes um, little blue eyeliner pencil. And again, it's a mini, but I think it's just so stinking cute. You get a little mini NARS Laguna, which I have a big one, but I guess this will be good for traveling just to throw this in the little travel makeup bag. The Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Opal. So hello, now I have... The cream one and the powder one, so awesome. And last but definitely not least, you get the OCC Lip Tar Mini with a brush. So the one that you get here is in New Way, which is just a really super, super hot pink color, which I think is gonna be absolutely gorgeous for summertime. So next to my Sephora bag, I got the Ico Black Magic Mascara, which I'm just like a mascara junkie for whatever reason. 
but I did pick this up and I've heard a lot, a lot, a lot of good things about this. So it was 24 bucks, which isn't the most expensive mascara there, so I was more than willing to give it a try and I absolutely just can't wait to use this guy. And I guess I'll open it up and I'll show you what it looks like. I think it, the tubes of this is really cool. Like, what is this little, it's like a concealer tube or something, but it's a mascara, so. I think it's really cool. This is my first Ico product, so I'll let you guys know what I think about that. Next from Sephora, I picked up the Tarte Golden Day Sultry Nights Eyeshadow Palette, and again, just really can't wait to use this. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you the packaging sold me on this one really quickly. This is the most beautiful colors. Holy cow. And then the actual palette has the exact same colors on it and patterns. So I was just like, oh my God. And then the bottom is just bright gold, which gold is like one of my favorite colors. Then here you get five colors. And another thing about this palette is the colors are actually really big. So it'll last you for a long time. You get a mauve brown color right here, which is an amazing transition color. And then you get this gorgeous creamy color here. You get a golden, a aqua, and then you get a bronzy color here. Which I think this palette is just going to be so amazing for summertime and I absolutely cannot wait to start using it. And then the last thing that I got from Sephora is the Dior Lash Plumping Serum. Now I got the mini one from Sephora and they definitely sold me on it. It is so amazing. It just looks like this. And I don't really recommend this if you're wearing false lashes because if you're going to cake on like a ton of mascara and then put your false lashes on, it just becomes really difficult to deal with. But if you aren't wearing false lashes and you want thicker, longer lashes, I really highly recommend using this before applying your all-time favorite mascara. It really, really lengthens your lashes and it seems to make them a bit thicker. So this was around $28, I do believe. So that is everything that I picked up from Sephora. I really hope you enjoyed this haul video and watching me dig through all my goodies that I just purchased at Sephora. Please subscribe to my channel and follow me on all my social medias, which they will be listed in the down bar because they always are. And I love you guys to death. I hope you are an absolutely amazing day and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.